You have the ingredients are a can of condensed milk, a can of Coco Lopez, and a can of carnation evaporated milk, a two cinnamon sticks, a one cup of rum, and a pinch of salt, and five eggs. And then you mix every uh, mix all the ingredients and and heat them up so the the milk gets the flavor of the cinnamon stick. And then, but don't boil it. Just heat it up and leave it in simmer like for 20 minutes, mm -hmm. half an hour. And then you have to strain it before you mix it together. Mm -hmm. And then you put um. He's trying. He does something. Put it in the blender and put the five eggs, but you don't exactly don't beat it too much because then it gets too hard. Just to mix everything do I need to let evenly. The, do you need to let the let the the mixture cool down before I put the eggs in there? Uh, yes, I did at room temperature. Room temperature, okay. Uh huh. And then you you make your caramel. I make my caramel in the microwave. Okay. I do just I put um like three quarter cups of sugar and you squeeze like not a whole half a lemon just like two strong squeezes and two teaspoons or a of um water two teaspoons to three teaspoons of water depending on how you like it you put it two minutes in the microwave then you stir it and then you put it a minute and a half again but you have to watch it because some microwaves are stronger than others and it burns as soon as it starts getting the caramel color you get it out because it continues cooking. Cooking. And then you put it in your pot, and then you have to do it in a double boiler. Right. On the stove or in the oven, and in the oven it's uh, 325 on the stove, uh, medium when it starts boiling, and then you lower it. And then pour it up in, if it's on the stove top, like an hour and a quarter, the same as, as in the oven. And then you just try it with a, the toothpick or something. A toothpick or a, a thin knife. And that's it. And then you cool it. There's no way that all the alcohol is So, buen provecho. I hope it's good and that you enjoy it. All right.